Hi, I'm Miki Tebeka. Here at Outdoor Labs, we value your time. So we created this series of short videos, each of them showing a cool feature of the Go language or one of the libraries. Enjoy. In this short, we're going to see how to conduct a binary search. Binary search is much more efficient if the list is sorted than a linear scan on the list. So in our example, we use a system to convert from numbers to the US system of grades of F, D, C, B, and A. So we have the cutoffs, which are 60. Everything below 60 is an F. Everything between 60 and 70 is a D, et cetera, et cetera. So what we do with our score is we call the new slices package binary search with cutoffs and the number, which is the grade. And if you don't have the new slices because you're doing you're using Go prior to 120, you can use search.searchins exactly the same. We get an index where if we enter something to the list, it's going to be still sorted and okay whether this value is already on the list or not. And if it's already, we increment by one. And finally, we return grades at that index. And here I have an example. So scores 33, 99, etc., etc. So let's run this one. And you can see, for example, that 70 goes to C, 89 to B, etc., etc. And this is what's nice about generics. Slowly, slowly, things start to creep in with algorithms that are useful on a wide case of scenarios and data types.